my channel and welcome if you're new here. My name's Jen, I'm a certified weight loss and nutrition coach and I'm on the WW Blue Plan. Today I have a math stock up grocery haul for you. I went to Target, Trader Joe's, and Costco. I have not been to Costco for about a month and a half, so I have a huge stock up haul for you. So you are in store for lots of new food finds, some killer, killer deals, and a massive grocery haul. So if you're new to my channel, stick around, subscribe. I'd love to have you. Make sure you turn on the notification bell so you're notified when new videos are uploaded. I do upload five days-ish a week, and there's a grocery haul every Saturday, so make sure you're subscribed. Give this video a big thumbs up if you love grocery hauls and you get tons of new ideas. And of course, check out that description box down below for my nutrition coaching website. I would love to help you reach your goals. I have everything from macro and calorie calculation. I highly recommend you take advantage of that service. Knowledge is power and you'll know exactly what your goals are every day. One-on-one -on -one coaching, group coaching, there's a little bit of everything. So check out my nutrition coaching website. Also down in the description box, you'll find links and discount codes to all of my favorite things and the link to head over and join my community on Facebook. We'd love to have you there as well. So we got a big haul, let's jump in. Boy, do we have a massive, massive, massive grocery haul. There are several things not even here on my kitchen island. I have an entire case of Coors Light for my husband, a case of Diet Coke from Costco, and a case of water from Costco, all of which are not featured because there's no room. You guys, I found some incredible deals. I found some awesome new food finds. I can't wait to share with you guys. So without further ado, let's jump in because again, massive grocery haul. So I grabbed myself a new pillow. This is a gel memory foam, simply cool pillow. This was on sale at Costco for $29.99, which is a fantastic price. It's a cooling pillow. It's a queen size. So basically a standard size pillow. It was perfect. I want something hard, but soft, if that makes sense. So memory foam is kind of the way to go. So I'm really excited about this. They actually had two options at Costco. I went ahead and went with the Pure Lux because it was just a little firmer pillow. So if you're in the market for a new pillow, $30 is a fan fantastic deal at Costco. I also restocked our heartburn medicine because I haven't been to Costco for a month and a half. So I had a huge haul and we need enough to last for at least a month. So these are on sale right now for $9.99, which is a great deal. So I went ahead and picked up two that should get us through. And then also a restock of our allergy medicine because we are almost out. $10.99 for $365, which is basically enough for an entire year or half of a year for two people. So I picked that up. And then Troy asked for a restock of his Premier Protein. He likes to have this. And in fact, he needs the vitamin K for his blood flow issues. So I always pick this up at Costco. Not on sale right now. It was actually $27.99 for the 18 pack, which still isn't that bad of a price. I don't drink them, so it lasts a really long time. And again, the vitamin K is what he's looking for. I also picked up a big case of organic chicken stock. You can't beat the price. It was $11 for six cartons, and I always, always like to buy organic when it comes to my chicken broth. I also picked up some pads because these were on sale for $9.99, and hashtag being a girl. So I picked those up and then a big box of chips. This is the great price, $15 for 54 bags. My husband takes a bag of chips every day in his lunch. So this lasts a long time because he actually works four tens. So he's only at work four days a week. So it lasts a really, really long time. And again, you can't beat the price. At Target, I picked up some of the Good & Gather Ginger Peach Sparkling Water. Right now, if you spend $25 on Good & Gather products at Target, you get a free $5 gift card. So I thought that was a killer deal and I've never tried their sparkling water. So I picked up the Ginger Peach and also at Costco, a restock of tissue paper. Again, you can't beat the price at Costco. It was $13.99 for 12 things of tissue paper. Basically, it's a dollar a carton, which you can't beat. Found some killer deals on non-food items at Costco. First is this two pack of a Nexus comb through finishing mist. I raved about this in my favorites video. You guys, two of these $7 and 49 cents at 
Costco. Yeah, you can't beat that price. I don't know if they're phasing it out because that is such a great price. These are about $12 per container at the store for a smaller container. So if you like the Nexus products, grab it at your local Costco while it's still there. And then are you not surprised that I picked up a spinach artichoke dip? Now I almost got two, but I remembered that I'm going to have to go back to Costco probably in a few weeks to pick up Diesel's medication and I can just restock then. So we love this dip, both Troy and I, no lie, are obsessed with it. And then I also picked up another container of the Primal Kitchen Mayo at Costco, best price, $8.79 for this big container. And I've just been using this for Troy's lunch as well. He doesn't know. And it's a much, much better ingredient mayonnaise. And then at Target, there was a coupon in the Target app for a him and hers product. So I decided to pick up their rest sleep gummies. So these look really good. They're like sugary gummy bears. You guys know I try to take sleep vitamins before bed. It just really helps me sleep better. So I'm excited to try out this him hims and hers brand. I picked these up once from Target before and I loved these. These are the Lemon Bliss Skinny Dipped Almonds. These are still on coupon in the Target app, so I went ahead and restocked. I like these. They're a perfect little sweet treat with some added protein. I grabbed the Good & Gather cheese sticks again because Target was having that incredible sale on their Good & Gather products. Excuse me, can I help you? Bubba, it's not for you, buddy. Not for you. And then I also grabbed the Good & Gather Mexican style reduced fat cheese. I was going to pick this up at Trader Joe's, but again, I was getting the $25 for the free $5 gift card, something I had on my list anyway. And then under here, I have two dozen of the organic eggs from Costco. I always buy eggs whenever I go to Costco, just because you again, can't beat the price. It was $6.99 for these eggs. And then I know this seems like overkill one two, three sets of the Bashia eye creams. Now, let me tell you, I hauled these when they first came into Costco. I favorited them because they're incredible. They are 100% vegan, pres preservative free, cruelty free, and no artificial fragrance or color. So I love this eye cream so much. I use the day cream. I really, really love the day cream. It helps with dark circles. It kind of helps with any puffiness. Then there is a night cream and an all day balm. This is really cool. If you wake up with puffy eyes, you just spread a little bit under your eyes and literally within minutes it depuffs. So I love their eye care. $5. $5 for all three at Costco. I think when they originally came, I paid $30 for this pack and then they probably are phasing it out and there's no expiration. So I grabbed three packages because $5, you guys, $5 per package. You can't pass it up. So if you like this eye cream or you haven't tried it yet, I highly, highly, highly recommend between this and beauty counter, they're my favorite. So of course I had to pick up three of those. No judgment. It was a killer deal. New product at Trader Joe's are these bite sized sharp cheddar cheesy crackers. I had to get these. They're super, super cute. And I thought that they would be kind of yummy dipped with this dip and just wanted to try them because they were a new product this week at Trader Joe's. Also, I grabbed some maple syrup. I picked up their fall edition because it sounds amazing. This is organic Vermont maple syrup, bourbon barrel aged. And I am completely out of syrup. I've been using it a lot for baking. And this is $9.99 at Trader Joe's, which is actually a really, really good deal. I also grabbed some egg whites because I've been using just regular eggs and removing the yolk to add a little extra protein to my breakfast. So I decided to just go ahead and pick up egg whites, $8.99 for th six containers. We paid over $5 for a larger container when I was in San Diego. So you can't beat the price at Costco. Also at Costco, I picked up these JoJo's guilt-free chocolate bars in original. Look at that. Oh my goodness. You guys, look how delicious these look. Now, they are kind of point heavy. They're 180 calories per bar and they have perfect, amazing ingredients. So I thought if I wanted some chocolate at night, this would be a good option. I've heard good things about JoJo's chocolates and they were on sale at Costco. This whole bag was $6.99. So you definitely can't pass it up if you're kind of a chocolate connoisseur. It's guilt-free chocolate, so it's a huge win. And then I picked up these uncured Land Jaeger. Did I pronounce that right? If not, let me know down in the comments. These are basically big meat sticks. And the only reason I picked these up is so my lovely, wonderful husband will not eat my Nick sticks. My Nick sticks are super expensive. You guys, I've posted on my Facebook group that I found them on Amazon. I'll link them down below. The most affordable price I've found for Nick sticks was on Amazon, but I don't want him to eat them. So I picked these up for him. They're individual wraps, so they'll be perfect to put in his lunch. So 
Here's crossing my fingers that he likes them and stays away from my Nick sticks. Restocked my Zevia at Target. I only have a couple cans left in my fridge. I honestly haven't been drinking pop very much, maybe once or twice a week. So this should last me quite a while. And then below that at Target, I picked up these pop tart bites. So these are in their Halloween aisle. They have glow in the dark pouches. How fun. But I got these for Troy. They're strawberry. I thought I could throw them in his lunch. I don't know that he'll like them to be honest, but if he doesn't, then I'll just take them to my real estate office. But they were on the target coupon and it's 20 pouches for about $4, which I thought was a really, really good price. And then at Target, I picked up the three pack big cans of pumpkin. Apparently there's a canned pumpkin shortage. My mom made a comment about it today and I've actually heard that from other people. This was $6.99, so I just picked it up. I cook with pumpkin a lot. And it's also great if you have dogs, if they have stomach or digestive issues, if you give them a little bit of pumpkin, it really seems to help. So I picked that up. Troy asked for BLTs for lunch this next week. So at Target, I grabbed two packages of fully cooked bacon making my life easy. As you know, I've been really busy with real estate. I'm slammed this weekend with getting things for our bathroom remodel in real estate. So this is just going to make my life a little bit easier. I also picked up a small thing of Dawn. Again, my lovely husband. I love him. Used all my Dawn soap and didn't tell me. And I actually use this only on my floors. So I pick up this really small container because it lasts me. I've had this same one for three years that we've lived here. I just mix it with water and wash my floors. It works like a dream. So I picked that up and then I grabbed some sour cream because we've been having a lot of taco type dishes and we're out of sour cream. So I picked that up. And then at Trader Joe's, I grabbed the two barbells. You guys have been asking me to try these. So taste test coming soon, probably in a what I eat in a day video, but I picked up the caramel cashew and the cookies and cream. I've been asked dozens of times to try these. You guys are loving my taste test videos. So I grabbed these so that I could give them a try and let you guys know my honest opinion. And at Target, I finally found the air fried chicken nuggets. You guys have also been telling me how amazing these are. I have to say the Kid Fresh ones were really, really delicious. We're completely out of them. So I grabbed these air fried ones. I like to have these on my salads. I like to have these as a quick, easy lunch or dinner because they're packed with protein and you can't beat the points and calories. So I picked those up under my barbells is some uncured black forest ham. Another thing I just like to have on hand at home is meat because sometimes I just want a little protein packed snack and I'll just eat a few slices of meat. So I generally always pick some up just to have on hand. New find are these fun Fetty Nestle Toll House morsels. Okay. I know. I know they don't have good ingredients. I know they're not good in points. I had to do it. I have a cookie idea that I want to make and it's not WW friendly, but I think my husband will really like it. So it's kind of for him, but I also thought you could have a little bit of these as a sweet treat. So it says vanilla cake flavored morsels with rainbow confetti. So I had had to pick them up at Target. And then also at Target, I grabbed the Califia Farms Almond Milk Creamer and Pecan Caramel. This one only has 15 calories per tablespoon. Sometimes if I have just hot coffee, like a second coffee during the day, I don't want it sweet. So I picked this up just because I'll get a little bit of flavor without a lot of sweetness. And again, this is on the Target app on a coupon as well. Lots of kombucha. I grabbed three of the Living in Gratitude Fall Edition. I did pick these up at Target. And then two of my favorite, the Ginger Berry and that way that will last me for the week. I still have, I think, two bottles in my fridge. I do drink kombucha every day, so I like to make sure that I stock up for the week so that I have it on hand for every day. And then at Target, I found these. These were a new find for me. This is the Good and Gather Apple and Maple Sausages. These are really good in calories and points. They are no nitrites, nitrates, and chicken raised without antibiotics with a mild heat, which is right up my alley. So I'm excited for these. I've been doing eggs with spinach for breakfast, and I thought this would be a nice addition to that meal. And then also at Target, I picked up the mini tater tots. Now I was going to get the big ones, but I opted for the minis. This is for my meal prep. So you guys stay tuned for that. I've never had the minis. And for me, I kind of feel like they're small, but I'm going to get more for my points and calorie buck. So mind tells me that that's a better deal. So I went ahead and grabbed the mini tater tots. I was completely out of just regular all-purpose flour. Target is the only place besides Thrive that I can find organic flour. Now Thrive is a better price. Thrive is linked down below. When you join Thrive Market, you actually get a free gift up to $24 value. You can get a case of chopsticks for free. So I recommend joining Thrive. Take advantage of the free stuff down in the description box with the link. But I did pick it up at Target. I am planning a Thrive order here in the next few weeks 
weeks, but I'm literally completely out. So I decided to just grab it at Target. Again, less expensive on Thrive, so check out the Thrive Market. I did grab a couple of containers of low sodium organic chicken broth at Target before I remembered I was buying it at Costco, but it lasts forever. So I did pick up two, and that's actually for a upcoming dinner recipe. At Trader Joe's, I grabbed some sweet potatoes also for a recipe. And look at this. I was so excited. I literally squealed when I saw these. These are the limited batch gingerbread cookie dough chunks. Hello, yum. I really like the Ben and Jerry's regular cookie dough chunks. You guys, I can't pass up gingerbread. I'm here for the holiday thing. So I grabbed this at Target. I'll definitely let you guys know my thoughts, but I was literally so incredibly excited. Everything else I have for you is zero points produce. So I have a head of cauliflower just because I need it for a recipe. Iceberg lettuce for my husband's sandwiches. Again, he's doing BLTs, so I grabbed him some lettuce. Green onions for a recipe, broccoli for a recipe, and then I also grabbed some tomatoes, mainly for his BLTs, but also I like to have tomatoes on hamburgers and on salads. And last but not least is one lone large apple for a recipe. Oh, and I forgot to show you guys the star of this show, this cute Merry Christmas sign. You guys, this is in the dollar spot at Target. There's one that says Merry that has a green frame and one that says Fa La 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 with a green frame, $5 in the Target spot. It's so cute. I'm obsessed. So I had to pick that up. So that is it, my friends. Whew, that was a haul. Now let's jump into what I am doing on my meal plan and what you'll be seeing Monday for meal prep. Oh my gosh, I had to tell you, these are delicious. It is complete gingerbread cookie. It even tastes like there's frosting, but there's not. You guys, get these. I had to hop on and tell you. I couldn't resist. I only had one, but I had to try them. I, so good. So here's this week's meal plan. It's October 24th through the 30th. I can't believe October is almost over. I feel like I say that every single week, but I have a great plan for the week as far as meals go. So Saturday is always an out to dinner day. In fact, we'll be out all day shopping for our bathroom remodel. So we'll probably actually go out for both lunch and dinner. Sunday, I'm doing a homemade chicken noodle soup. You guys will see this recipe if all goes well on Wednesdays, what I eat in a day. Monday is a steak stir fry. Like I mentioned, we have tons of beef from ButcherBox. If you guys haven't jumped on the ButcherBox bandwagon, highly recommend. Grass-fed, grass-finished beef for fantastic prices. And right now they have ground beef for life when you sign up for a subscription. I do have a link below for $30 off of your first box. So at least check them out. I find their prices to be the most affordable. Tuesday is always a leftover night because that's a jazzercise night. Wednesday, I'm making taco mac and cheese. Uh, yes, please, tacos and macaroni and cheese. Thursday is a chicken broccoli rice casserole. I'm pretty excited for this too. And then generally on Fridays, we have leftovers just because we do have some leftover from earlier in the week's recipes. And here's the plan for meal prep. Now you'll see all of these recipes on Monday in my meal prep video. So breakfast this next week is going to be tater tot sausage casserole. I was really wanting a casserole and for some reason I wanted tater tot. So perfect pairing of both of those items. Lunch, I'm making an autumn glow salad. So I'm pretty excited about this. This is not a traditional green salad. This is actually like a real clean whole food salad. I'm excited. And then I am making for the first time ever on my channel, my homemade protein bars. So I've been thinking about these, trying to find the perfect recipe, because as you know, most protein bars don't have the best ingredients. So I'm trying to see if I can formulate a low point, low calorie, good ingredient protein bar. And I'm gonna try these no bake, double chocolate protein bars. So again, you'll see all of these recipes on Monday. So stay tuned for meal prep. Thank you for joining me on another huge, massive weekly grocery haul. I hope you got some great ideas for some new things and head on over to Costco to save some killer money on some great products. I don't know how long they'll be around or if they're at every Costco, but definitely head to yours and check them out. Again, if you're new, stick around, subscribe. I'd love to have you be part of my channel. And if you love grocery hauls, give this one a big thumbs up. Don't forget to check out that description box again for my nutrition coaching website links and discount codes to all of my favorite things, as well as the link to join me on Facebook. We'd love to have you over there as well. Thank you guys so much for watching and sticking out through this big grocery haul. Have a great Saturday and I'll see you next time. Bye.